Were you surprised by this very frank admission? Um, as it suggests he was quite parochial in his outlook, which is a surprise in some respects, because you think about his father, um, Bush Sr., who'd been a, a former boss of the CIA, you would imagine he would have picked up a sense of how the world worked from Dad. Well, I was more surprised by the frankness of his admission than by the admission itself. Um, I'm not at all surprised to hear that a governor of Texas didn't know much about uh, the wider world. I'm not at all surprised that somebody who eventually became uh, president of the United States, and that was three years later after this meeting, um, didn't know anything really significant about the world at that time. And I have to say that a year later, when I returned to Texas to see Governor George W. Bush again, he had by then just about decided to declare his run for the presidency and had created a kind of brains trust of mighty experts on foreign policy to um, give him teachings on the various, uh, the various issues around the world. And I should also say that, what am I talking about here? Three years later, when Tony Blair paid his first visit to the United States to meet George W. Bush as president at Camp David, the, uh, uh, the president's retreat, um, George W. Bush seemed pretty well versed in issues dealing, for example, with the Middle East and Russia. So uh, looking at this in hindsight, uh, surprise is not really, I think, um, my, my first reaction. 